Hello, good morning everyone from the port of Lebanon. This is my best friend from childhood. We Hello. grew up together. Hi. Today good. he's taking the time out to show me around. But something you cannot miss, I know it's a travel channel, but as you all know, I also like to bring you the other side. No, everything lovely, jubbly, you know, everything nice. As you know, last year, Lebanon experienced an explosion at the airport, at, at the port of uh, Beirut. Today, as it happened, we are passing by and I'm gonna show it to you now. This is where they store the, the flour, the wheat and flour. And this is where the impact was there. And as you can see, the devastation, I mean, it's okay now, it's been cleaned up, but you can see the devastation of the port. So let's take a walk as far as we can to show you. I don't know, you can see in the distance some of the ships. It's been turned on its sides, capsized and everything. But, you know, I think it deserves us just a little video to see how things are here. You know, Lebanon is my home country, as you all know by now. And it's sad to see it, you know, in such a state. Revolution, this, that, the dollars now, the currencies messed up. We all got our own problems in the West and in, 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 in the rest of the world. But you know, this video just to show you like how privileged we are, how lucky we are to have a proper government, proper system in place, so Lebanon suffered a lot. And when I say Lebanon, I mean the people of Lebanon. Every person in Lebanon has someone abroad since the 50s up, on, up until recent times. You know, it's very sad. And uh, my friend actually was in the area when the explosion happened. He say it's like a nuclear. His car stood up, and he was like only a couple of kilometers away. Say some of the buildings, you know, this this building like is being renovated now, but you can see there that building. And you can see up there, I mean, now it's been like almost seven months. So since then, they have been doing a lot of work. So like, in a way, I'm glad I wasn't here when it happened or when I come back. But look at this big ship there as well, look. There is no top. You see, look, there's no roof. Everything you see is incredible. I mean, they built in some hangars there and stuff like that. So, you know, it's sad, I don't want I don't, I don't want you to be sad, Talafo. I don't want you to be sad, but I just, I think it's, it's good in a way, make you people appreciate what we have. This country is, uh, people are living for today. Today, you don't think for tomorrow. They think for today, we, they live daily. This building used to be two buildings, look. Half of it gone. I mean, this is obviously it's the airport. I mean, it's the port here, obviously. So it's gonna be, you know. But still, you know, this is the main heart of uh, of, of the uh, export. You know, the import and export into this country. So anyway, guys, this is it. This is just it. And uh, have a good day, guys. And remember always to be safe and always appreciate what you have take care guys until the next vlog bye bye see you later